Hello, everyone. Welcome back to DG360. We are on our 100th episode of the Azram campaign from Viva La Dirt League. <laughs> That's awesome. Look how far we've come. 100 episode extravaganza tonight. It's a it's a doozy. It's almost an hour long, so let us check it out. Hey, Greg, you, you right, mate? I'm talking right now. <laughs> Top of the mountain now? Top, Top of the peak? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've seen a large stone theater? Hey, as, as your security, we should probably blend in a little bit. Oh, darling, makeover. <laughs> yeah. Welcome to Mother Horn Theater. This one's Enderland box. I am going to rig my bag of holding above her seat. Quite a beautiful view, isn't it? Oh, he so needs to go away first. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, fuck. Yes. We act <laughs> Oh, I need my process uh, isn't you processing. Go away. Us actors, we can't work well we with can't. audiences, apparently. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. I just can't act when someone's my process watching doesn't me. Come. Sorry, let me rephrase that. Can we just have a little bit of space just to practice our lines? Right. Uh, of course. I'm afraid I can't leave oh, you no. alone in Enderlin's box, though. But I'm happy to show you the green room. Okay, guys, we really need to come up with a plan to get him out of here. Okay. Okay. I mean, we could pretend there's a fire downstairs. No. We could set a real fire downstairs. Oh, that's not a, not, not, a very, not a very good idea. Um, oh, God. I've got an idea. Okay. Roll, roll with me on this, okay? Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, come back, come back. Come back. <coughs> hey, puppet, where are actors? Mm, oh, uh, yeah, the, darling. Yeah, darling. You, you know how actors are like the, really I precious can say about so much the process. Right now, Maddie, like I, this, I think you should go away so we can work on our process in here. Sorry, what, one second. Was that your good plan? That was a great plan. Shh. That was a fucking terrible plan. Can I just say that Rob's actual face when he does the lip thing for the puppet is actually scarier than that mask? Can <laughs> fucking <laughs> is, that's, a, <laughs> that's like a really that's a scary thing to think about that Rob's face with his lip doing the uh, the puppet thing is actually scarier than this mask right now. Uh oh oh I uh, oh you know what puppet. Could you show me to the green room? Of course. Yeah. Right this way. Right. <laughs> okay. I mean, okay. first off, who agrees with me here? Am I the only one that thinks this way? Yeah. Oh, but he's saying he's saying in place, but <laughs> oh. he's not moving. Yeah. Um, okay, well, you, follow. Because he, he's literally follow. his little, his own string. Yeah, yeah, right. I'm going, wow, shit, how do you we go? Follow, follow and see what happens. And no, 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 you can't follow him. He's stuck. He's in place. <laughs> yeah, no, but <laughs> if you can walk past him. So, so I, I walk past him and you he... You walk past him out into the hallway. He whips right. up into the ceiling, leaving you guys So let us know. Oh, yeah, Roger. absolutely, darling. Let us know. Thank the, you. Just the great claps okay. behind him, and then he comes back down at the top of the stairs. And, and, right uh, this way. That's right. Yes. And where am I sitting right now? Right. Oh, so wait, 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 start going down the stairs. So seems like so he's left the reference. three of us, and he's the, left the three of you. Well, I can't believe that works. Yeah, that's easy. Yeah. Um, okay. And I just stick my head out the stairway and just keep an eye out. Yeah. Could you Is little perception perception check yeah, up yeah, into the? Yeah. No, it's not down the hallway. There's a little. Okay, so what is the last hag's name and how powerful do we think that she is? I'm feeling pretty powerful. She has her own theater uh, and minions, scary ass puppet. She's going to be difficult. I can't remember her name. Mm, the hole in the roof. Yeah, yeah I know. Yeah. Yeah. I'll keep a lookout. <laughs> he goes out into the hallway and looks yeah. down the hall. Well, um, just pops in behind yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, geez. I'm, I'm doing a little look up and into the hole you, in the roof. Make sure he's How really gone. How are you doing tonight, Kira? Anyone you. else do better? Thank you. <laughs> okay. 14 plus Perception things. Five, I think you said before. Five, yeah, 19. 19. All right. So you'll be on lookout if he if sounds yeah. of him okay. approaching come. So I, um, I go, Greg, uh, could you tinker Drink me up something me. that could be like a like a remote time, just tiny explosion where I'm going to rig the bag of holding above her seat mm -hmm. and uh, then we can just backstage go Doop, and it goes and drops onto the drops onto her. Goodness. Yeah. Sure. Yes. I think Positive I can do that. But how, <laughs> that how big place. is the bag of holding? Big enough for a humanoid. Hopefully okay, she's sure. a humanoid. So well, you're telling me this is, we, we could potentially solve this without bloodshed. Potentially. Do, doing that way. Yeah. I'm all for it. Great. So uh, what are you trying man, to do? Man, you really what, have what, changed. What yeah. Yeah. Once, that last, once, that last once thing once really the, snaps Once the performance yeah. is happening. I, I'm, I want to do this without bloodshed. Once the performance Let's... is happening and we can see that she's in her seat, just go deep. And what I... happens? She's inside the bag of holding. He's, he's, oh, he's oh, helping she's... to drop the bag of holding. Oh, it's like a magical, like, everything. So really quickly, whoever she's there with, whoever she's there with, 
Can't they just pick up the bag of holding and shake it out? Um, well, but we, we need to add a bit to the plan of yeah. like make sure that people She's who aren't alone. performing <laughs> are we, we, we need a, ba- we need a you guys to come in and <laughs> grab the bag of holding. Maybe, yeah. maybe, maybe. Something like that. This I is just, not going to work. Yeah, I mean, this might work. Can we get? Uh, uh, it feels can like we... a pretty big gamble. Just hoping that the bag will drop perfectly on her and encapsulate her fully. Greg, I'm glad, I'm glad one great, of you pointed that out. Greg's doing some great tinkering to make sure it doesn't. Uh, <laughs> well, well, I am. Well. I'm, uh, I'm going to do my best here. Yeah. Um, yeah. Re- should we also talk to the, to the acting troupe to see if they've got like any? Can we try and make some uniforms? They look like security uniforms, so we can position so, station someone outside the door. Yeah. They could then go in and grab, grab the, the bag. The bag. Um, I feel like a good plan always has multiple fail safes. This could yeah. just be one part of a yeah. bigger plan. Yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> This definitely won't work. What is, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> that's my feeling. That's my feeling. Yeah, this yeah, definitely yeah. will not yeah, work. Yeah. Yeah. I, ju- I just know it won't. Yeah, this won't work, and I'm going to tell you why. Let me just say, the inside of the bag is infinitely larger than the outside of the bag. So for this to work, the actual hole of the bag has to be large enough to g- g- fit around the hag. And unless she's, there's no way, because the bag itself, here, here's the definition of the bag of holding. Inside the bag can survive up to a number of minutes equal to blah, blah, blah. Here's the, here's the most important part. This bag has an interior space considerably larger than its outside dimensions. Now, the inside is much larger, larger holds more than the outside. It's a magical bag, okay? But listen, it ha- she has to fit through the actual hole, which is only roughly two feet in diameter. But it might work. No. I mean, like, I'm trying to think. It, yeah, well, I'm a pretty big guy. Like this way, I don't know. I don't think it'll work. Two feet in diameter, the hole. Like she has to fit in a two foot diameter hole. A hag. A hag in a bag. <laughs> a hag in a bag. <laughs> can we, can, like, I'm not too fussed about losing this bag or having to go back and get it later. Yeah. As just part of a larger plan, let's rig it and see Thank what happens. Thank God Ben oh, did. How high, hang on, how high is the ceiling in this room? <laughs> let's have a, as we start putting it together, how? Uh, about 15 feet high. So there's a chance that this, this oh, bag could just kind of go... Is, but if Greg rigs Actually, some like about, uh, about, about the size this. Okay. So you want to have like, that, like these kind of weights that kind of... How big so is, the, how big is the, the bag? Enough what if, to put what if a you, as a bat, flies up there with the bat uh, and gets the bag if we've rigged it up, and then you turn into Bob and you bag go, of holding, <laughs> Bag of holding mouse is about that wide oh, that's gonna enough, be to, oh. enough to like squeeze somebody, uh, a little bit bigger than that. Oh, you need enough to, s- to squeeze somebody into it. Oh, you need to squeeze oh, okay. it. So like, oh, you have I seen, was, you have seen, it's not like a, it, I think yeah. in the rules it says like it's a two foot wide diameter. Okay, so they really need to either be. I just have a thought of color and. You know that people. This little bag it's just here. a bag falls onto a head. Oh, just ben, oh, just Kira and I are the oh, only oh, ones oh, 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 Since, right since it revolves around it, let me look up the item so I'm getting it right. Um, so you have seen somebody be put into it in your vision. You saw Nab put Fib yeah, inside of a bag right, of holding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But he but was he was, restrained, he was restrained and he could just like put, put so it over his head. Or they need to be dead or willing. And think about how big the other hags we've seen have been. Yeah, they've been big. The it's roughly two feet in diameter at the mouth. Yeah, I just read that. Okay. Foot long, two. <laughs> okay, so everyone else uses like a foot long oh, sub as yep. two foot long subs. <laughs> okay, so once the bag of holding is rigged up there, then we snap it down, it falls on her, and yes. she's captured. Great. Right. Uh-huh. Bob How had a vision of his brother put in a bag of holding. Four yes. or five meters, maybe? Right. Wait, what's that in feet? I, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, okay, I think I've got a spell that can help us out here. Oh, uh, right. We can use Subway sandwiches to measure up okay. to the... We can use Subway sandwiches, okay. Okay. So one foot, two yeah, foot. Yeah. Foot longs, yeah. That's yeah, great. This is definitely the most efficient way to do this. I can't, go, I can't go any higher than that. Can you damn it, one hole in our plan. I can't. Ah, damn it. I used up my whole spell tinker slot a ladder, for, for mm. And then we can hold those up higher. Long. Yeah, because these I are, wonder if there's something else we can tinker to measure things. I don't think so. It's the only like, way. A, like a like a like a measurer, some like kind a, of like a, like a, some kind of tape that could measure things. Like a, yeah, are you guys measurer. making up words? What words are you guys using? <laughs> You're right. You're right. Okay, let's, let's try, try again. Tried and try again. Try and true measure. subway sandwiches to measure everything. Yeah. Okay, so there's one. Two, I'll hold that one. Three, yeah, okay, and then we've got that one. Four, and I'll hold this one. one. You got, yeah. Five. Five. We need the snap ladder still, damn it. I think of my foot. My foot is long. 
Okay, so this is not the best plan. Um, <laughs> no. Mm. Okay, it was a good, it was a good thought start. Okay. We we did all this stuff. We got the marinade to go in. Marinade's like, right, here's my plan. Right, yeah. we're gonna rig up the anyway, small I'm bag and drop it in the green room. room. I'm Downstairs. back from the green room. How did you go with uh, things here? Downstairs. Firstly, uh, at the green room, you saw that oh. it was a pleasant, old-fashioned green room in dire need of redecoration and refurbishment, though, like kind of peeling walls, yeah, right. wallpaper and stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, there is a bowl mm -hmm. in the centre that is filled with fresh fruit. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And he says, just along here are the dressing rooms, if you care to see them. God, that face. Uh, I'm, Rob, I'm, I'm, uh, uh, I'm so so you know what? I'm so so going to the, the rest of my uh, theatre <laughs> trope. The mouth, <laughs> just, oh. <laughs> I just, I'd like to go back and see the, my theatre trope, because they'd like to see these things Oh, as very well. well. Right this Let's way. Let's back this way, yes. And we're back. <laughs> right, okay. how, how did you go with the um, just, just a decision that this... Maybe might not be the, might not be the best seat in the house. Ah. Oh, I would I would beg to see another uh, one. Yeah, well, it's subjective. So yeah. yes, right. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's kind of a metaphor. Yeah, kind of a metaphor. Yeah. Okay, um. and and we and we leave. I I uh, we, right, we need to like debrief somewhere. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah, so let's go to the green room slash dressing rooms. And Very start. well. Well, I went not. Well, yeah. Let's follow for now. But it's night time, I guess. We should so this is the green room. There's some fruit here if you want some. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Is this our accommodations as well? Uh, green. You don't sleep in a green room usually. So I mean, I mean like, is, 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 is the is the like in place in its entirety? Uh, yes. Yeah. You will be staying in the theatre. Yeah. There are there are um, uh, what's the word accommodations? I guess yeah. in, uh, built into the dressing rooms. So could, could we, we need the Ocean's Eleven this shit and just get. We like, really need like, Ocean's Eleven this shit. We've, like, we've got acting. Act, we've got actors. Props. We don't have like whole wardrobe. I like, I like your, your I wardrobe idea. Uh, I just Wait, what, who's Elizabeth? Is the seamstress or someone else? Um, bum, 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 bum. We can chat to the Ian. seamstress and Ian is the uh, is the one who makes costumes. We're gonna talk about the whole Viva Plus thing. We could chat to him. Try and find out what the security uniforms look like. Yeah, like is the security around? Is there, are there anyone you, the only person the on the staff of Designing. this entire thing is the marionette it seems so yeah you wouldn't be able to get past him like he'd be like you could act like him um, you could act like a ma marionette uh, yeah could do we'd have to get but you're on stage you have uh, oh, a mask stage. of familiar faces yeah. so yeah, you yeah, could yeah. make yourself look like a marionette but I'm you wouldn't have the strings I'm performing on the yeah, night performing. yeah uh, I mean, you could just give one, the mask to one of us. That's oh yeah, the, yeah. yeah. So you oh, look like marionette. You wouldn't have the strings, but you could potentially look could, like marionette and illusion, the illusion the strings. The strings. Yeah. You could maybe it's yeah. And but then, then as soon the as you marionette never turns <laughs> up, <laughs> and then as soon as you have to like move anywhere, you have to zip yourself up into the ceiling. <laughs> mm, yeah, that's a non-starter. Is there any other places that we could visit just to oh, fully yes, scope out? Oh yes, where would you like to see? Area? Just um, anywhere that helps where the he has. Uh, so a plan. Anywhere we could kill him. The, I mean, <laughs> the, 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 the stage. I would love to see where I'm going to be of performing course. from. Right this way. And he, up into the ceiling. This way. Leads you along to the stage. It is a very large uh, stage. In fact, I'll show you what exactly what it looks like. Ooh. Ah. And obviously, Kettle Steam has been here doing things. She's been also. here the whole time. Yeah. She's been helping the actors. Uh, yeah. Work on, their, work on their accents. <laughs> accents, yeah. Um, <coughs> oh, so this is the stage? The whole so thing's the why, stage? What's with the giant spikes? Oh, yeah. Where is yeah. that? It might be a coliseum, not a stage. Yeah, yeah that's a coliseum. Um, we can make this work. We can make this work. Where did I point my other thing? Oh, they're over there. Um, yeah, so in terms of plan, it could be like a distraction of a p performance. Someone is. We need to get rid I wonder of, what of Marinette. I wonder if there's a character from Mandolin. Just kind of like, uh, he's on a, a massive figurine. stage for the first time in his Rob entire life. A figurine together for Andalin. <laughs> he's, he walks this right and just breathes breathe, breathe, breathe it in. Is this the stage? Or Look at that, bro. Just give me a second to it. Kind of looks like a stage. Orient it, you. Orient it. Why is this not sticking? There's a trap door. There is, as with all of What's it feel like, Greg, treading the boards? Um, all right, so this is the box that you were in. Oh, yeah, that's in Looking down, box. forty foot drop right there. All right. This is the pro is this is the promenade. This is these are the seatings around it. This mm. is the promenade bit that sticks out in front of the proscenium arch. This is the actual stage bit with wings and flies and covered bit uh, and yeah. a trapdoor down to underneath the okay. stage. Something to do with the trapdoor. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
I'm very aware of that D&D &D <laughs> thing though, where we go, trapdoor, oh, that's the plan. And here we are at the stage. Nice. Very nice. The stage is nice hardwood floors. Mm. You've got the promenade that's oh. been here the whole time. Yeah. The new the new lighting's around the front of the thing. That's and beautiful. there's, of course, the trapdoor that leads down under the ground. Uh, the fly are yeah, above. You can see the light. The trapdoor is going to be very nice. Yeah. Yeah. doing the play. Yeah, that's a trapdoor. It's yeah. all yeah. 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 going to come out. The trapdoor is now something I can see. The horizontal doors that are, oh my god, the trapdoor is obviously very important. The trapdoor is definitely <laughs> well, no, well, it doesn't have to. It's just part of the world. Yeah. Let's have a let's yeah. have a little look at the trapdoor. Yeah, let's have a little investigation. Hmm. Yeah, you have a look I, at I it. Presume. Uh, the trapdoor works from both Darling. both, uh, both so sides, we, above we, and below. We can use this. Oh, this will be great for the scene when the person pops out from. So the people stage. can come up. Uh, yep. the trapdoor. There is a lower, Again, lower part. Just as you great open the, improv, mate. As you open the trapdoor, you see that there is um, essentially like a winched uh, a winched elevator bit be okay. beneath yep. it yep. Um, that it's leads like down onto the under underground area. You can see that underneath the stage. Underneath the stage that is where they keep a lot of the storage of old set pieces and things like that. You can see that there's a couple of the actors fantastic down Fantastic for your reveal. Mm. Um, I, I just, agree. Uh, we'll we'll be using this. this. Uh, he's in the wings at this point. Um, I just on, kind of walk away. Uh, can you distract him from it again? Uh, the marionette. <laughs> His marionette. Uh, can, My name is Poppet. Pop Pop Poppet. Poppet. Thank you, Vermillion. Welcome to the fam. Welcome to our Viva La Dirt League Dungeons and Dragons viewing. Appreciate you. It was very rude of us not to ask you yeah, that. Earlier. I apologize. Could you show me? Forgiven. Oh, I'm very interested in Wait, this, this tile. I don't know. <laughs> Just, can you tell stage? me about this, yeah. this tile? I mean, of course. And, and as that happens, from the wings pops back down. As that's happening, the tile. I just ca I cast, it's a different um, color because back in the, the uh, yeah, years the section before, a a we were struck by lightning, <laughs> and the, this part of the stage fell on fire. And I cast uh, just so he can't see me casting magic. I cast uh, detect magic. I just realized while we're up there, we should have checked to see if there's like a magical barrier in front of the. We should um, have. Good man. <laughs> so you're going to go to the front of the stage, detect magic, to is see it if there's anything is, is, it, it, is, it, is it fireproof? <laughs> is it magic proof? Is it everything proof? Uh, with your detect magic on, you see that there is no abjuration magic around the front of the, the box. And they're really uh, prepping seem to this be fight fireproof up. or there's no force field. They have a lot of advantage get, going into, into this fight. You could from the front, you could jump out. You could put a spell up straight through it. spell up through it. Great. Okay, good. Has anyone got any C4? Did you paint it? Yeah, we could just plant do, do, do. under a chair. Yeah. Do, do, do. What's that? Do, do. We can, I'll remove the bit. We can remove the bit. Yeah. I, can. I hope this isn't as much preparation as it was on the last hag, where they went crazy, ridiculous, and then just ended up smashing it into the house and burning it down at the end. That was a lot of preparation. This one, not so much preparation, but it seems like they're getting uh, they're getting the their their leads. They're figuring out like every perceivable angle, and hopefully they're prepared when the when the fight. Comes. Think that, I'll think that out. Think that. <laughs> take, take, I can take, take a sound that makes can, a non beep. This is a, this is a get up. <laughs> I am not C4. I am not C4. C4. Ignore the beep. Ignore the beep. Ignore the beep. I guess I ignore the beep. I'm just going to cast again just to look at the rest of the. There's literally just no. Uh, you don't need to cast it again, uh, although you do need to roll a wild surge mm. for casting it the first time. <laughs> Fireball. Fireball. <laughs> no, yeah, I wonder if that's, is that fireproof? <laughs> Detect magic. Fireball! <laughs> no, it's not fireproof. Here's I have the tested it. Um, you, uh, so your trigger's up to a two now. One up is a slip. One now, yeah. Um, uh, oh, sorry, so it is two now, though, yeah. yeah. De Detect magic is uh, a ten minute thing, you can concentrate oh, so on I'm it, so you just turn around and look around. On the stage, anything? Stuff. I feel like we need to, like, like, because uh, I could, I could kind of remove myself from the crew pretty easily by the <laughs> rehearsing on the stage with mm -hmm. the, with mm -hmm. the other actors and stuff. If we want to split out and divide and conquer somehow, I just want to like. Uh, let me tell you what I think. We're just gonna. I, I think we can do all the planning we want. At the end of the day, we're just gonna fight them out every other. <laughs> but let's let's start with the plan. Every sure. encounter of Wild Beyond the Witch Light, Bars, and that's right, my version of Wild Beyond the Witch Light, has the option to get around it without combat if necessary. Yeah. Did they think about us playing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, they did not. So you can get it through without combat. It is an option. The only way I can also see an op option for combat. You just so want to so so just, just for uh, to get because we, we have to kill the hag though, or you have to get her get her to drop the spell somehow to drop, to drop the, spell. the spell or kill her to drop the spell. Um, with your detect magic, you see that each of these things around the front are basically the stage lights around the front of the promenade. They are each magical. Uh, each of them has um, small minor uh, transmutation on it to make the um, the ever, ever light. 
uh, ever-present lights on there. Mm -hmm. um, and then you also got uh, minor sort of, what's prestidigitation? Kind of prestidigitation magics for like minor fireworks and things. Right. Just is there, and things. then is there any other lighting in the... Uh, there is, yes. As you look around, you can see that above the stage at this point, there is a rig of lighting just between like the, cool. the, the, the flies. What if we really quickly do a rewrite of the play? And and the play is about is a, is about forgiveness and stop. specifically forgiving just stop a group of adventurers who have just killing your sisters oh. killing, killed some sisters <laughs> yeah, and okay. we're, we're at fault. and we're, we're, we're all going to act in this now we you guys can actually join in or like I can <laughs> convince the rest of the acting troupe and then while to... she's watching the play we kill her <laughs> <laughs> no, no. the tra the play is just so moving mm -hmm. that, that it kills her <laughs> she has a no. heart attack uh -huh. that she is forced to see the um error of a witch and she kills herself. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, and that's not what I'm going for, but if that's ha if that happens then That's not as sad as it Yeah. Um, and we can so we could get Shakespeare to write a really moving mm. uh, if, if there's one person to do it, it's Shakespeare. It's Shakespeare. It's Shakespeare. And he could he could write a piece. It's the tragedy of the oh, it's like basically our story. Our story our we story. started out trying to do good. And then, and then basically things started to go worse and worse, yeah. and then we started to lose our path and our way. And I think it would be, be really nice for Greg to be able to vent <laughs> like yeah. a lot of the stuff on, on the stage in front of everyone. Yeah, and then, and then, and the story yeah, is how it's it's the, folly and, and, the folly of revenge. Yeah, the folly of revenge. And, and, and then how we finally get it's basically <laughs> it's the whole, not work. With everything that's happened at this point, and then it gets to the point where it's like, and now we are And here. now it's up to you. It's all metaphorical. And it all opens up and it goes, and the lights go back on the audience. This is such a bad idea. It's a play about how these dudes just kill two sisters and now now it's up to you this is like oh it's horrible it's a horrible idea specifically this so booth like, and then it's like, and a spotlight you and then play about how we killed your sisters and we'll really 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 sorry <laughs> and then if it doesn't work yes. yeah yes let's do it okay. so we are we're, writing this we're writing <laughs> a new <laughs> play well, we're gonna write a new play okay. we, has shakespeare gone to bed yet no, you can go and find it. I think it might be really difficult to convince them to change the play. There's going to have to write the hell out of this one. I've been practicing one. Romeo and Maglubiet this yeah. whole time. Uh, so you go, you make your way to the dressing rooms. I hope she wasn't hoping for Romeo and Maglubiet. Maglubiet. It's, uh, it's the D&D &D, um, god of goblins. Right, right, right. Romeo and Maglubiet. Ma Romeo and Maglubiet is a romantic tragedy about a man who falls in love with, falls in love with a goblin. I know this But one. his whole family is uh, from like, <laughs> no, goblin slayers. And mm, it's just cool. classic. 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 It is a classic. Star -crossed, Star -crossed lovers. Star-crossed lovers. Star -crossed lovers. I hope the hag isn't like looking forward to that because that's not what she's getting. <laughs> I think we just do the wrong place. Like, boo! Kill everyone. <laughs> boo! We'll find out. We'll find out. We'll find out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yep. <laughs> so you go to the, the dressing rooms and you guys are like, you guys are in part of, or, uh, either part of the play or we've got a plan B I, I, think, the I think we're in the play now. Okay. We're, we're, we're trying to do this non confrontational We're going to yep. try and like, do Great. this with just okay. our... Right here. Let's Words. continue. Uh, they, <laughs> the dressing go. rooms are old in need of refurbishment. They're lit by oil lanterns. Uh, they've each got a wardrobe in there that's kind of like peeling. Uh, and posters of The Sun Never Shines, which seems to be some tragic play that uh, was played here once. It's kind of old and faded. Uh, attached to them. Each are basically military cots, not the nicest accommodation, but it's enough. Uh, you eventually find Billy the Shakespeare's one, and he, uh, he answers the door. Yes! What? Uh, uh, I mean, you can d lay yeah. out the plan. So, uh, hey, Billy. Yes! Um, like, uh, we should probably get Lawrence <laughs> in here as well. Lawrence as well, actually, yeah, like, we should really get the whole Lawrence. team together. Darling, can we get everyone together for a quick meeting? <laughs> in the green room, ladies and, and gentlemen. Room. Ladies. Green room! Lawrence says and comes trotting down the hallway. So green room meeting, last minute. You know how we, wait, we, we, wait. Did, we did you a... Let's pitch this as like it's going to help save lives. Yeah, 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 yeah. So... Well, I guess hopefully it will. Uh, well, let's start it by... You know how we, we saved your life before from the jab jabs? Jab jabs? Jab jabs, jab jabs, yeah. uh, we, need, uh, we need a solid. Um, hey, Lawrence? What's this about, Lawrence? Oh, I, I didn't call it, darling. <clears throat> our, our new uh, acting friends did. Uh, are we going to basically confide our entire truth? I think we have to. to. <laughs> this is a job for Paradoom. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> All right, I think our only option is we need to tell the truth. If we want them to put on a play about our story, <laughs> yeah. we yeah, need to tell them our story, right? Yeah. Starting with, we're on the run from Honeywood, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah, we need to tell them that we killed two of the hags. Yeah. You know? We need to come completely clean that we don't want, we want a non-violent solution. Yeah. Yes. But we will go violent if we have to. If we have to. to. We have to. Yeah. Right? And we're on the run from Leithel uh, and the whole thing. And yeah. here's the answer. You know what we need? 
<laughs> we need someone who just loves dumping exposition on people he's just met. Whether it's a good idea or not. Yeah. I heard you guys <laughs> need an exposition dump. <laughs> my name's Bear Dude. I've lost all of my powers. I used to be the high sorcerer, but now Liam is the high sorcerer, and he's on the hunt for me, and they're kind of helping me get away. But I have to say, I lost all my powers, but I'm slowly getting them back, which is the good thing. We actually got on the run from Honeywood, but then we went up that north. Really good. I, I, I so, think my really name's not actually <laughs> Stephen <laughs> Foley. I'm sorry? Sure, sure. I'll take the ring. <laughs> and I, re I really, job. really quickly um, recap the story we've been on and how that this is much bigger than this event it's well, a world maybe, maybe admit the details that make us look like the clear yeah, bad just, guys just, just, oh, yeah. <laughs> a few of the dudes <laughs> about, as you know, as abusing that talking, poor old woman and ruining her life you know I, 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 I'm, I admit some of the details but at the same time I'm, I am not going to just forget about the the, the, atrocities. the, the atrocities we've you're, you're caused. Show that we are broken. We're broken. Like we're we are flawed. <laughs> we are flawed characters that yeah. need a redemption arc. Yeah. Yeah. As you're as you're talking, Billy's like sitting there, standing there with his, his spear. Oh, and yeah. at one point, he yeah. um yeah. Yeah. Uh, he he gives it one like, and the the spear sh shrinks down to a quill. Oh. Yeah. And then he whips out a, a, sc a scroll and starts to just write. Yeah. He's inspired. And we I I, I <laughs> just tell him. Everything and and from the heart, from the heart, and and some of the moments we, I, I, it just comes from a, but it's, it's a musical. It becomes a musical. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. okay. Why did you do this to me? Yeah. Why would you do this to a me? A musical in which two sisters are killed. Uh, it's a musical that you we, we, son we, of a bitch. we always get. Well, Bodgers can sing. Uh, yeah, great. <laughs> Bardoon and Bob Club. I gotta come clean, you guys. <laughs> we started with such good intentions, but that's all changed now. <laughs> when we first began, I knew who I was, but now I look in the mirror, oh, God. and I don't recognize the man staring back at me. You know, I think this is best translated through song. <laughs> we started out with good intentions, but how quickly they turned bad. <laughs> Oh, my darling, hello, oh, my oh, right time. I don't know yeah, if we should do a musical, musical thing. Okay, We're okay. not good at singing. Not really. Just baby. continue the story. That's not my keep, strength. I'll, <laughs> just, well, I'll just keep talking. I'll just keep talking. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, guys. We'll, we'll worth a shot. Um, can I take it back? We can take it back. Uh, I, I cancel that part. Scratch that. Scratch I, that I know out. from experience uh, that Shakespeare is not good at writing. <laughs> no, I like yeah, that you can sing. Okay, that's great. Yeah. 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 Because Rowan. Out, so I, just, I just thought we'd be able to convey. Uh, you know, music, <laughs> musicals often convey a lot. In Bob a, in just holds his weapons again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I didn't know that. But I figured that's out musical. great. Uh, it's not a musical. <laughs> continue. Continue. Oh my continue. God. And, and it explains that. And so we're actually here to. It's the whole story. We were here to kill. Hey, yeah, I think I guess so. Yeah, the whole thing. This, they gotta be in on it. Yeah, gotta be in on it. We don't want. We want to end the bloodshed. To yeah, to avoid bloodshed, we need your help. We, we need. We need. We need you to write a story <laughs> that gets us to the point. If, if this understand. doesn't work, I guess we also need. If this doesn't yeah. work, there's shit's going. Shit is gonna. Shit's going to go. As you, as you finish, and I don't want that anymore. As you finish, you look to them and say, "So we need your help." This is gonna work. This is not gonna work. They all stand up and they're like, that's oh, beautiful, it's just moving, and the story, it was just, it had twists and turns and redemptions. What a truly marvellous story. Yes, I can see it now. It starts 78 years into the Third Age, a time of relative peace among the kingdoms of Azarim. It's the end of a particularly hot summer, and we're in a quaint town of Honeywood, just as the sun begins to rise. Uh, we should start with Bodger and his morning routine. Yeah, well, what I imagine I'd be doing is I would have got up, had a coffee, done some pull-ups, you know, some push-ups and stuff, and I'd be, I would have been working on some old knight guy's armor. Yes, That's like a, a commission for a knight. A, a commission yes. thing, yeah. It's yeah. super important that you get it done, otherwise yes. he'll besmirch your name all over yeah. town. <laughs> <laughs> I don't expect you to remember, it's like two years ago at this yeah, point. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wonderful story. Yeah. I feel like it's almost like a hundred episodes of story. <laughs> It, it would make a good YouTube series. Yeah. <laughs> it would make a series. And it starts with uh, the, the elf. I think, I think we start. Has this been two years in time has actually elapsed? Is that what Rob is saying? The two whole years have actually elapsed? Holy shit. That's 50 episodes a year. Oh, oh, okay. 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 Uh, Started with the yeah. elf finding himself unconscious on the riverbank, and uh, and then we go back okay. to episode one okay. and we watch okay. the whole thing again. Like I thought the story. Story. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I just want to see our timeline here. Okay, let's let's go back to the very beginning when we started this. We watched two years of episodes in one year. We have doubled the rate. Hey, that's pretty good. We watched two years in one year. We're going to catch up. We're going to catch up. We're going to get current. We're going to get current. At this point, yeah. they recap the story again. Yeah. We're in a loop. We yeah. get stuck in an endless time where we all lose our minds. Yeah. Yeah. We're uh, efficient. Charles We're efficient. What's, what's your name uh, yeah, yeah. Charles? Yeah, uh, Charles, yeah. What's your, what's your, what's going on? Going on? <laughs> yeah, they do. They have yeah. a deadline. That's um, why I was wondering about it. I'm like, why? This is How is that even possible? Of course, darling, anything for a fellow thespian, we can wow. we can write something up. Wow. And, We're says, catching up to him, uh, Maddie. Yes, uh, lots of plans for good uh, ideas flowing. <laughs> <laughs> I guess tomorrow. Just need to, good good verbal, just need to, need to find words that rhyme with Skabatha. And he's going to stay. He's going to stay up all night writing the new play. Uh, and where do you want this new play to end? What's, is it like a tragedy or is it like a redemption? Co- uh, I, think, well, it's a, I think it's an open end awesome, one there. That would be awesome, don't you think? Allows the... So what's the, what's the, should, what's the really genre going to be? Tragedy, comedy, uh, romance? I think it should be tragedy, right? It's tragedy. Like, what, well, it's, well, like, it's, it's what has this world it's done serious, to It's serious drama and, and it leads up. It's a very similar tragedy story Tragedy definitely like, ends tra- tra- Tragedy like, ends bad, comedy ends good is the difference. Yeah. Comedy doesn't necessarily mean it's funny. It leads to a point where it's like the... We're at the precipice, and it's like, and then then the spotlight will go on. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And it's like, really quickly, are these how does speaking of? Like oh no, 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 no! Don't put the spotlight on on the only surviving sister. That's just too much. That's too much. It's not going to work. That's a bad idea. Spotlights are probably overthinking it. Are these spotlights manned? Can we coordinate the spotlights all the, turn on? There is a technician box uh, that you haven't checked out as well. Darn, we should, we should check out the stage, box. stage manager and technician <laughs> box. Uh, oh, sorry, control, I suppose you, you, like. now you know that we're actually not like that. We're actually just people. Uh, I, have I, we, have I think that became clear, yes. <laughs> uh, yeah. Wow. Wow. Lawrence, darling, I do need to make a confession. Oh no, whatever is it, lovey? I don't know how to say this, but we're not actually thespians. Yes? <laughs> I've been meaning to confess this for a while. In fact, we're adventure. This isn't even my scarf. Well, no, it's ours from the costume department. Uh, no, well, exactly. You know, we, we tricked you, we, we liked you. Well, no, you. We, we hired you as bodyguards. Yeah, we knew we, you. We, we tricked you with our <laughs> we, lesbian and Right, right, yes. Oh, I'm shocked. Yes, I'm sorry that I have to reveal that to you. It's, it's quite all right. Yeah, right. We met you, we gave you a scarf. I'm just going to keep that. I'm keep it. We, we met you at the time when you just burned Scarlet's oh, house down and murdered right, her darling. and ripped her spine out. We already knew, darling. It's not us that... <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, no, yeah. it was me that you were trying to fool. It's that damn barbarian IQ. I have a little touch of the barbarian IQ. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, well. Oh. Hello. Oh, shit. No, wait, 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 wait. We were talking as us, <laughs> right? What? Oh, what yes, of course. You, did did the marionette? Does the marionette? You all, you all went to the green green room, so nobody was distracting him. Hmm. <laughs> oh. So, do we have to kill the marionette? <laughs> 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 that literally felt the way through my head. Right? <laughs> Um, no, I say to the I say to the marionette. Oh, that would be well, an error. I, 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 for real, just, Maddie, I, I would turn never do that. I turn the sadness in my eyes. I'm like, you, you, oh, you, you, no, you, you, you've, just got, you've just got the inside scoop on the new play. You wouldn't tell any it of the audience like members. Like a wonderful you? play. We didn't. What did we say? What did we? You, 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 she does not like spoilers. I will not tell. Oh, yeah, yeah, we didn't actually true. say anything. Okay, we haven't yes. said anything. Yes, yes. Good. you wouldn't want to give spoilers for any of the audience. No, she would snip my strings. Yeah, it's good. Okay, well, thank you. I untangle the marionette. <laughs> there you go, now we've helped you. Okay. Well, hey, marionette's sweet. Oh, God. Oh, um, we've solved okay. that problem. Great. How is there God. always one key thing we forget? <laughs> always. I literally... We, we, we I get caught up so much. He doesn't give out spoilers to audience members. We... Okay, <laughs> so what did we do? We talked to just... As, this is us talking now, not uh, not us as characters talking. Yeah. Um, we just talked about the play, and we talked about the journey that we've been on, and we want a redemption story. And we killed a couple of hags. But yeah, th- that's going to be obvious in the play anyway. Like, yeah, that's, not, that's, that's not um, hidden information. Yeah, that's fine. Um, well, I mean, is, is Shakespeare writing an exact, or is everything metaphorical? So they're not necessarily, in the play, they're not necessarily hags. That's something very metaphorical. They're, yeah, they're it's like kind of whatever it is. Shags. Shags. Very, yeah. Um, <laughs> they're three <laughs> sisters or mermaid sisters. Yeah, or, yeah, the three mermaids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Three queens. Called Bavlona, Scavathan. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Um, Three queens yes. of Denmark. I think okay, so. I, th- yeah. I, I, I think we're okay because we yeah. didn't we didn't talk anything. Wait, did we say anything about 
Well, no, yeah. no, we're, yeah. no we're, we're we fine. definitely did. No, we wouldn't have necessarily used to set that information. No, no, we definitely we, did. We, we, we were like, the, this is the plan. This we're plan. gonna. We we said we're trying to get out of here with blood without bloodshed, but mm. we definitely said we need to write a play to convince Ewellyn to let us go. Or shit's gonna hit the fan, marionette. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so if it goes badly, we're gonna kill it. <laughs> Um, so can I? I, I want to do like an intelligence check on the marionette to see if he just thinks that we've been talking about the play the entire time. Uh, that would be an insight check, I mean, check. and I mean, it would be a disadvantage because he has a wooden face. Okay. So he doesn't exactly. He's got like, the most I poker face. 18, of poker 18 faces. or 18. Hey, 18 plus insight. Uh, two, I think. Okay. Not great. I mean, he definitely heard uh, the four, whole actually. thing. Twenty-two. Um, he hasn't shown any reaction so the only thing you could read from him is body language and his body is like this so it's also very difficult to read he doesn't give any indication that he's scared of you right. I mean to be fair even if he's heard the whole thing he knows that we're trying to get out of this without yeah. bloodshed but bloodshed is definitely still on the table that's fine if it's on the table <laughs> let's try it's right. plan B <laughs> plan B right, <laughs> right. And fast forwarding. Yeah. Fast forwarding now. We're gonna we're, we're putting the plan to action. Yeah, yeah. I, I think oh. we just come out. Yeah. Just come All out. right. Let's see what happens. Yeah. All right. I sharpen so. my blades just in case. You uh <laughs> you you have a long do, rest. Do we ask the marionette to leave us alone while we sleep, please? Like <laughs> <laughs> Of course. Oh or maybe you I'm should not a creep. <laughs> Thank you. Could have asked you to do that before. Good night. Good night. Mm. Long rest, we wake up and I love, speech. I love what's happening now that I can see that nobody else can see. Only Daft and I can see this. Betty is going off right now. This is the best thing in the world. Betty is an old subscriber here. The auto mod kicked in <laughs> and labeled Betty as a suspicious user. But listen, what, look at what Betty is typing to me. This is great. So much chit chat. Do bloodshed. Good God. Bring the fire. <laughs> There's so much like I'm reading this. I think Daph can read this as well. The best part is like watching Betty wants something to happen and then realizing that he's watching Viva La Dirt League. I don't know if Viva La Dirt League's Dungeons and Dragons is for you, Betty, because we've been watching a hundred episodes of this. And this is kind of what you could expect from this campaign, bro. <laughs> Plus, Betty has had a lot to drink tonight. <laughs> I love watching Betty's like going off like put an arrow in the bitch's eye <laughs> I, I still haven't I still haven't figured out what Betty's drinking yet <laughs> this is this is it bro this is what it is <laughs> right. what is the topic of your speech can I please have everyone's attention mm -hmm. oh. this is about redemption <laughs> right 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 this is right, a, right, a, man. a uh -huh. speech I want to make about it's redemption great. Great. okay so <laughs> my brother stole my hammer from me. Okay, I'm that, adding six okay. to the index. <laughs> <laughs> you have to start, you have to, have to, have to stand one. and listen to the whole oh, 10 minute Rob. speech. Nice, Damage Betty. Nice. By one I love Rob. Do you see that? Yar, you be drinking that right to drink. <laughs> Just over half. half. Just over half inspired, <laughs> actually. Yeah. Like 60% inspired. Rob's one of my faves. Okay, so I give you a rehearse all day, because none of us know this play yet. Yeah, so we need to rehearse. I'm just playing myself. We need to. Oh, uh, yeah, Miss Kira. Damn it, Kira. I have the play. something to talk Great. Excellent. Oh, uh, unless, unless she can play a better role because she's an absolute mimic. Oh, uh, yeah. I can do off screen voices. Yeah. Off, you, off you, stage you, voices. You, you could Steve. play a lot of the other roles of, of uh, all the different people that we've been. Will do. Yeah. I remember lines very easily. Good. <laughs> Maybe you should play a lot. Huh? <laughs> oh, no, Maddie. <laughs> so we all spend right. all day rehearsing. So the next morning arrives and you make your way uh, to the stage. Um, you see, you see <laughs> Poppet uh, appear at your 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 doors. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> uh, time to, to get rehearsing. Uh, Endelin will expect a, a polished play tonight. Well, she can expect all she likes. <laughs> <laughs> Greg has a new sense of. Um, there's, there's, a, there's a sense of hope about him now. Like it's a, gl a, a glimmer of hope. That's great. That's great. A, glim a glimmer of the old Greg is back. <laughs> you, um, you make your way to the stage. Uh, it is it is obviously morning, dawn, um, and uh, sitting up in the box as you approach, uh, as you end, enter the stage, is a very large woman. Um, oh, uh, fucking what? She's seemingly quite hunched over, but tall, and she's standing, uh, sort of sitting in her box. Um, <laughs> Oh boy. With, a, oh with boy. like ruffles, what are they oh, called? Whoa. The pe petticoats? No, what no is those are the other bits. The bustle uh, oh, and the what is paneer, I think it's called. not fit over um, Endolin. Yeah. Oh yeah, she's mm. wearing cheese. <laughs> she's wearing a cheese <laughs> curry. <laughs> a whole lot of 
Um, and she's sitting up there um, she's already with, there. Behind, a, behind a veil, just, just oh, watching. Boy. And as you enter the stage, she says, <gasps> Welcome, my new guest. I oh. hear there's oh. a play tonight. Hello, my <laughs> love. <laughs> yes, there, yeah, there is a play tonight. I guess we can keep up. We music. cannot yeah. wait ah, to entertain ah. you with our Hello, it's adventurer. Why well, you sound like David Bowie from Flight of the Concords? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Hello, darling. just a sweet transvestite. <laughs> um, you will be my most favoured guest my, tonight. Might you be Endela? Uh, Endelin, we've heard about you. I will be. Yes. Oh, yeah. The creepy. The, this is a creepy oh, voice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Rob's so good. Uh, creepy. All right, love. All right, well, um, we don't want to ruin the play, so it's, it's, <laughs> yeah, it's we're way too huge. Yeah, we're going to do it. We're going to put a bag over So, but we you wouldn't you want to get ruin ready it. for the play of your life. Oh. Oh. Darling. <laughs> you go Darling. Off the stage. <laughs>I like how Alan threw in the fucking darling nonchalantly. Hold on, hold on. ...of your life, Fun. darling. <laughs> you're welcome to stay, but we don't want to go so for the Wonderful. Oh, creepy. I would hate for it to be spoiled. And then she just kind of backs out, away from, out of sight uh, over the balcony without turning around. All right, let's not let that <laughs> deter our performance. <laughs> oh, my, right. my. Kill that thing, energy. <laughs> <laughs> the energy just got sucked out of the room, man. Endolin, some creepy, creepy hag. They're going to have to be on their game on this performance tonight. Ooh. Just Ooh. Burn it with just, fire. Oh, so, look at that. Oh, we should kill that. <laughs> <laughs> we should kill that. All right, love. Hello. Uh, we are your um, murderers. Ashes. <laughs> and uh, we have come here to kill you put on a play for you <laughs> and we really hope that you die. enjoy it that's what i wanted to say i want to jump inside you and explode you from the inside out i want to bathe in your blood i should go before i do something i regret i really want to do okay uh, as you are going to attempt to put a plot, uh, play together, uh, I need you guys to each make a performance check. Uh, this, this is, is about how well go your rehearsals horribly. go. Each of you can make a performance check, but oh. you can make it based on whatever stat you want. So you could make it strength-based performance I mean, or dexterity-based performance. So go go performance well, anyway. dicks, dicks, but, but you have to justify it to me. You have to tell me what it is that your, what's your part of the play and why is it right. a dexterity-based performance? Uh, 30, so 17 uh, persuasion, persuading, yeah, and pers uh, performance. Oh, uh, performance? Yeah. <laughs> um, okay. So, I, so what can we choose then? You're saying we can uh, choose yeah, you could, make it, uh, you could make it, say, a dexterity-based performance check. So you could add uh, two instead of one from your charisma. Oh, uh, I see, I see, I see. Okay. Right, I right, got right, right, uh, 21. And what I'm, I'm not, Baradun himself is not going to be on stage. He's going to be just doing major image after major image after major image. Right, right, right. Four major that's images, because that's all I can do. Or six with, major images. With, because with wild hitches? <laughs> I mean, just throw it, let's... Because you've got, you've got minor illusion, which is a cantrip, doesn't require what? Well, oh, do, 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 like do, do some minors and, and some minor when needed. if it can fit in a five foot box. Yeah, yeah. But when needed, uh, something larger something or like I don't think moving. the play needs like grand spectacle or anything. This is like, it's quite a, you know, <laughs> a human story. <laughs> <laughs> but, 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 but there's a lot of, there's going to be a lot of shit that happens. Though, yeah, right? but we've got costumes and we've got, you know, <laughs> what are you, are you starting the, Are you starting the story at like episode one of this Which story? Like, Shakespeare starting probably starts with the narrator. When you guys meet? Yes, I would say so. Like coming oh, out and giving a bit of exposition. I mean, well, okay. Well, I rolled re regardless. I rolled really well. So whether so or not I'm doing, whether or not I'm doing spells well or doing I'm doing it myself, I rolled illusions really well. to assist. Yeah, uh, my one is fourteen. Uh, fourteen. Yeah. Okay. Uh, sorry, I need to be writing these down. I forgot. Um, so what was this your total? Twenty. Twenty-one. Fourteen. So yeah, there might be some illusions. Maybe probably not major image because then I don't have to. I'm. I did dexterity because Bob's. A really wooden actor. <laughs> yeah. He just can't do it. He's like, yeah, what? Yeah. Hello! Uh, what's my line? Um, so instead they put him on stunts. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Awesome. Okay, okay. Doing stunt work is great. Yeah, yeah. Um, what was your total? So I got a 10. 10 total. 7 plus 3. Yeah. So. Wonderful. Well, we'll be in touch. Thank you. Next! <laughs> Hello, darling. All uh, right. What's your name? Uh, Bob. And what will you be performing for us today, Bob? Uh, uh, um, 
I got two of the uh, monologues from small small town. Is it small town? <laughs> small village. <laughs> small village. <laughs> uh, yes. Well, in your own time. Okay. Where do I look? Oh, just just yeah. over here. Ignore the audience. <laughs> To be or not to be, that is the question! Okay, um, um, just sorry, just stop it. Stop. Sorry, I'm nervous. I understand. Nothing to be nervous about, just ground yourself. Do a bit of. Oh, give yourself a sound, baby. And then, Down no, here. Not, no, you can stand, stand back up again. Just. Sorry. Just, it's my first time. Just take a deep breath and go again. <sighs> oh, fuck. Okay. okay. To be or not to be, be that is. A little, little bit quiet, a little bit quiet, maybe just. Okay. Find it more oh, hang on, how about this? How about this? Hello, my darling. Hello, my uh, baby. No, okay. Hello, uh, honey, my honey, 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 um, honey. Yeah. Tell me, how are you at taking a punch? What? Stunt man. Oh. Oh, perfect. Oh. Stunts. You'll you'll be perfect for stunts. Okay. Right. Excellent. Next. Good. Thank you. That reminds me, I have to watch Fall Guy with Christy. I hope it's so, good. So I'm not a, so it's. And not just uh, like I rock, can use my athletics. You can use strength base. So what's your charisma score? For girls. Strength, strength, uh, my strength charisma is plus two. And your strength is plus four. Plus four. So you, what's your performance? Uh, performance two. <laughs> two. So <laughs> yeah, instead man. of adding two from charisma, you're adding four from strength. So just. If uh, you can justify just, so your, why. So your role is a. Your, your role is a this plus four. As a as a this plus four. Four. <laughs> eight. So you got an eight total. I guess so. Tell me what your why, why does the why does the rehearsal go so poorly for you? Um, so it's based on on it. Do I have to make it just strength? Right? But you're, 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 you're doing do some kind of strength based performance luck thing, check. A luck thing. Can you roll again? Could do a bin luck. Or, 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 or you could oh, use, or, or you could use your. This is the re, this is to determine how well your rehearsal goes. Oh, right, just rehearsal. If you succeed on a particular number that I've set, <laughs> then you will have advantage on the actual performance check on oh, the night. Oh, I think okay. we want it. Yeah, we want the advantage. I reckon use your uh, uh, inspiration. inspiration. Yeah. My inspiration now? To make it <laughs> And I'll bend luck on this bit better. Four. Four. Great. Same roll. <laughs> <laughs> right. uh, so that was eight from you, and then Kittle Steam, who is performing with. Ooh, pretty good. Uh, plus a... Uh, ooh, good. All right. Now... She might have saved you. What's that? I, what are we doing with what's that during that? Can I use I magical know. guidance I, on... A People. I don't know. Uh, he could, I don't he think could do his so. show number. He, he could do his like, little so. thing. We could, we could give him his oh, yeah, little... When you make it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we could give him his little dance. <laughs> What's it joins the dancers. Yes. What's it is the dancers. He's a chorus dancer. Yeah. He's a chorus dancer. <laughs> Any intermission... I'm like, comes. left! Right! No, left, you f***ing idiot! <laughs> he comes just, out I don't know why I'm looking so full of rage. Don't yell that. You have to use your mind. Yeah, I used my mind. I was like, oh, so that you So that you're aware... What's it is a demon, and as such, he is chaotic evil. And as such, if you give him a, any sort of command, he will always try to interpret that in his benefit. Well, this was my other always, thing. Was like, so you've got to be specific, as long as you can specifically tell him what to do. He will. He's bound to follow your orders. Yeah. But if he can interpret those to be something where he gets to tear something apart, he'll do it. Can yeah, right. you just put him away? Can we put him away for the play? I think the play needs to go well. Just, you can. <laughs> you can just. And he goes into oh, a, just pocket, do that. pocket dimension. I was going to say, I just berate him and tell him he's just terrible. <laughs> and he needs, to go and, he needs to go and practice by himself. <laughs> no, because it's like... Just put him into pocket, pocket, oh, pocket oh, dimension. Oh, 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 I, go, I think that's how you dismiss him into a pocket yeah, dimension. Go, You're terrible and he just... <laughs> you need to go into the other dimension, into the void, and <laughs> practice your dance moves. <laughs> <laughs> practice your <laughs> dance moves. Please, please mother, I'll try! <laughs> <laughs> Such a terrible relationship. <laughs> um, okay. So no, you, it's, it's the only way he'll learn. You made the uh, so it was a combined total of all of yours. So your good score and Kettle seems good score made it for your <laughs> bad score. Such a good um, dance, mom. But you succeeded on the rehearsals. They, go, they went well. It's exactly you, like watching dance, moms. We talked about that. A lot I think last week on the stream. <laughs> like already a little bit cathartic already because you're rehashing some of the stuff you've been yeah. through. Yeah. Well, I mean, I guess we'll tell you our story. So, so Where do we even begin? Yeah. yeah. Well, we, yeah. we yeah. I guess what started in Honeywood when I when I tumbled out of a portal <laughs> after Layeth. Remember Layethil yeah. threw me through a portal yeah. into Honeywood. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and I was, I woke up after gambling debts naked. Yes. 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 Yeah. 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 yeah, I saw your penis. Yeah. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's right. right. Yeah. 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 The swamps, the volleyball. Yeah, that's the right. frogs ate our stuff. stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I grabbed all Conrad's tongue. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, you yeah. did. Oh, well, your stealth has been horrible. Oh. Remember the time that I just jumped off an airship? Oh my oh, god, you I did. did. Yeah. You were yeah. just like, I was just like, yeah, there's a man. He'll catch me. Yeah, I got some dead bodies in my hut. You do. And to be fair, he caught me. He did. He did catch you. He did catch you. Remember that first. Fight with the little frog guys and oh, I died. Yeah. You, you did die. Yeah. I was yeah. trapped in a net. Oh, yeah. oh, remember? 
My grandfather's hammer, that's rightfully yeah. mine. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember that. Remember that, yeah. Yeah. Remember that? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Remember all those other fights where I died? Yeah. Oh, yes, like yeah. the wolf fight where you died, yeah. and the hill yeah. giant fight where you died. And the crag cats. And the crag cat yeah. where you died. Yeah, yeah, oh, I died. Oh, oh, and, 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 and the thing with the moth? Do you remember that? <laughs> he dies. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, and there's a time where my brother stole my rifle as rightfully mine. Yeah, my hammer. You guys remember when Bodger wouldn't shut up about his hammer? I do. I do remember the time we met a god, and then they took Grin away. Yes. yes! That was horrible. Yeah, that, was yes. kind of that was really dark. Is, is, is this the actual play? Because, oh my god, it needs some fucking work. The only thing unifying about this play right now is the music. What, it, I hope this isn't the performance that they're giving Endelin right now because I have to say she's probably booing in the stands right now. Uh, he was meant to have a date with that uh, nice reception lady. Yeah. And then that didn't really happen. <laughs> yeah. Remember, the bodies are still there. That's away. right. Yes. Oh, yes. traumatized an old lady. Remember yeah. when I climbed inside of a hill giant, ate its blackened insides, and cursed myself with eldritch <laughs> powers? Remember when we murdered a guy in your shop and his dead body is still there? Yeah, I chopped oh. off his head. Yeah. Remember? Like how my yeah. grandfather's hammer was like, I keep talking about it to inspire you. Remember that? And remember, keep talking about it and it and remember how you, you kind of pushed your entire family away while we were in Scotland. Yeah. And I don't know if they... And really remember liked. Dirk! Remember Dirk? Oh, we Dirk. traumatized ah. him so badly. I tried he so hard. Himself. I tried so hard yeah. to get through to him. Oh. I just could. I just needed a bit more time. And you're Poor Dirk. And Pearl. And Frank. The destruction, the chaos, it's starting to hit them. Chris Goldhorn, we murdered him inside his home. Yeah. It's getting he better. Was just, he was just kind of trying to this live his life. It's getting better. And then this we just burned down better. a tree for yeah. we potentially did. innocents. What? Well, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. And, we, and we blew up the first hag's house, which had a, had a few innocent animals in there as well. <laughs> oh! Yeah, no, we're, we're um, yeah. good oh. times. I also uh, tripped over that old man and broke his hip. We're doing one of those horrible sitcom things where they do a repair <laughs> episode. Yeah, they're doing, yeah. They're doing a, 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 a clip, clip show. show. Yeah, yeah, a clip yeah. show, that's it. Uh. So you have advantage on the check tonight. She, uh, so if there's nothing else you want to do during the day, uh, we will cut through to it. The, the, night, the night I falls. I don't think there's anything. No, I don't think there's anything. <laughs> we, have we instructed the tech crew that when the play ends and we're all there, Last line, the lights go up to her. Light so we just up. need to make so sure the tech crew sure, know to that. Yeah, and we're obviously just assuming that you, the... You go to the tech, bo tech box then, where the, um, the, the levers and things are for uh, the buttons and stuff for the lighting, uh, and op op knock on the door and open it, um, and there's nobody in there, and you turn around to be like, oh, I wonder who... And then you hear a slat open and... <laughs> <laughs> pops in and goes, okay. Hello! You want, to, we, you want to check so out we, the tech box? I mean, you heard what we were talking about earlier. This is... Oh, no, so he's not the tech guy. Yep. Oh, he is the tech guy. Okay, great. He's so, every role. And I forgot to mention as well, every time he... So he was dressed like a doorman when you first arrived. Every right. time he reappears, he's dressed in whatever. <laughs> he's like front of house staff and he's like um, a is technician. There, is there just one of him or are there multiple of him that... that yeah. kind of we yeah, ask him. Sure you haven't worked that out. Should we ask him? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Uh, 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 this is just one of you... Uh, or are you multiple of you that come down from different spots? What do you mean? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Things are much clearer. Were you, mean, were you, are the, you the only one of you, or are there multiple? Like, did you, I couldn't did, run a whole theatre by myself. Did, so, so you, you, you didn't greet us at the door when we first arrived. No, okay, that yeah. would have been the doorman. That's the doorman. So there's oh, multiple. Oh, so which one was listening oh, to us? But no, but if, that means that he probably can't. If he's stuck in that position, like. Then he can't. Oh, it's just the green room one. He's the green room one, and hopefully. Were we in the green room? We have no idea how this communication shit works behind the scenes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They could talk to each other. They could talk to each other. They probably, they probably have a green room. The strings are probably like the old. Have you, have you heard the play that we put on? Yeah. Sorry, have you heard the story of the play that we put on? Yes, I heard. Okay. So then you are aware of what we are about. You like it? Plan to do the story. You wish to have a spotlight on Endelin's box at the end of the show. Okay, so somehow that... She's gonna love it, darling. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure about that. But we'll just, find out. Just exit. It's completely disappeared. She's gonna... Oh, uh, it's because he's it, putting on a I, I'm on my thespian accent. What about um, Do you wish John. to see how these things work? I just really hope that this is... There's Alan talking, not Greg. I really hope the marionette... Um, ruin acknowledges the fact that if shit hits the fan... He's the whole die. building will burn down. <laughs> <And> <laughs> Crazy Alan, dude. Crazy Alan. <laughs> they will all die. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Um, Hopefully he really wants to. He really is. He really has that tendency in real life. Um, I love it. And I'm back. 
Right, uh, right, right. I was going to say, okay, so before we get into the play, we actually need to talk about once we're there and the spotlight's on her, what are we going to f- say to her? Well, um, okay, I'm just assuming really quick. So Shakespeare, have, we've read the script at this point, obviously, because we're rehearsing mm-hmm, it. Mm-hmm. We're like, the ending of it does need to be very powerful. Are we very happy with, when we read it, are we happy oh, yeah. with the... Right, right, right. Are you Kira, questioning right. Shakespeare? This is not going to work here. This is not going to work. How do we, re- when we read it, when we read it, are we happy with it? It, the, is, a, but, like, it is a Shakespeare. I'm pretty sure that Shakespeare. one of the final lines is, and now the power lies with you. With you. <laughs> so. And and to be super clear, it is tragedy, 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 and then like you end on like a slither of hope. You have the choice choice to make this yeah, yeah. worse yeah. or better. What happens now? Tragedy. Yeah, yeah, or yeah. Um, and you choose you choose the genre. But uh, but then if she chooses like good, I'm gonna not kill you. Um, we need to have a bit Fireball, of a, uh, yeah. <laughs> we need to have a bit of a plan of uh, like can, asking her, can you please remove the magical barrier? Yeah. Can you not overlord? Uh, well, forest? I assume this is all. I mean, to to think, to think that there is a probability of a success here is is an error. <laughs> this is faulty thinking here. To think this has any chance of working, it's going to end. It's going to end in a fight. It will definitely end in a fight. Well, that's all set up, so it becomes so we, we within the within, within the, the play, play itself, we're talking about all the stuff, and okay. her choice will be cool. Okay, yeah. like that's all part of like the reason why we're here, and why we've had to kill no, I can't wait the metaphorical. This, I can't wait for this to not work and just have then, to fight her. <laughs> right. Anyway, but let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Okay, sweet. All let's right. Do it. All right. Uh, I already already hear like I feel like that's spoiling it just right there. Listen, we will watch the next episode next week. Also, we're thinking of having and it's pretty well 100% at this point unless I say it's not going to happen. But on the 9th, which is next Friday, I believe I said 7. Let me let me look. Let me just double check here. We are going to have a Viva La Dirt League trivia night. Yes, August 9th at 7 p.m. We are having a Viva La Dirt League trivia night in a Jeopardy-style format. I think we have up to four players. It might be five. So we're going to limit it to five minutes per person. They can either get on mic or they can type in their answers. I will purchase a $20 Jeopardy kind of board that schools use, and I will write down Viva La Dirt League uh, questions. And there will be many, many different topics, Viva La Dirt League topics. The winner, um, I'm not quite sure what the prizes are yet. It will involve DG360 merch. I think we should do like a gift card. What's up, Azrin? Thank you. Welcome to the fam. So, you know, I want there to be some prizes, like a first and a second place prize. We're going to have four people. And then afterwards, if we feel up to it, we're going to watch some more Dungeons and Dragons. So we'll have a Thursday night Dungeons and Dragons, and most likely we'll have a Friday night Dungeons and Dragons after our Viva La Dirt League trivia. So I want to do more things for Viva La Dirt League fans here because we have so many. And I want to thank you guys for taking the time to be with me and uh, anybody, for that matter, to, to just chill with us. It's really nice to see you here and be with you live. And it's also nice for those people on YouTube that show up. Try and get here live if you can. Thank you. Don't forget to like and share if you're watching this on YouTube and try and get here. Um, Thursday nights, normally, we have our D&D around 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I appreciate and love all of you. I will see you on the morning show. You guys better be here for the morning show. Lots of cool things you guys have found in our Discord. Don't forget, if you are here live and you're new, you're going to want to join our Discord. Awesome people there. Um, And you can have great talks. And uh, you can post what it is that you find on the Internet that you like. And uh, we watch it on Friday morning. So hopefully I'll get to see you on the morning show. Thanks, everyone. Have a great night and see you tomorrow.